this whole question of whether you have criminal exposure as the president, you can be indicted, say, for obstruction of justice, um, doesn't include the idea that there is information here. There's a lot of talk that Mueller could write a report detailing right. presidential behavior, including potential obstruction of justice, that becomes fodder for a political process should they pursue impeachment proceedings against him. And then it's not a question of the law, but it's a question of whether there's high crimes and misdemeanors. That's right. Impeachment being a non-legal process, but ultimately a political one. And Mueller is indicating that he's looking at two reports, potentially. One focused on obstruction, the other about Russian collusion. But to, to Jeff's point, look... <clears throat> Trump could look at this news and his lawyers and feel a degree of vindication. See, I sold you I wasn't a target. Problem is, subjects can become targets. Sure. And this is why Dowd, really, his former lawyer, was really focused on him not testifying, the danger of him making a misstatement that then could expand the scope. But now he's really down to Jay Sekulow and Ty Cobb. And Sekulow is not, you know, necessarily the, the A-team. Uh, and it's a sign of chaos. Even Ted Olson, who was interviewed for this position and turned it down, um, said, you know, there's just chaos inside the, the uh, president's legal counsel. Because so it's they, a serious thing. I mean, they think that what we've heard is that they think that the president doesn't always take their advice, and so that's a frustrating experience. But what well, does it mean, the fact that Jay Sekulow, <laughs> that he's down to Jay Sekulow? As well, you know, Jay, Jay Sekulow is a him. very smart lawyer. He is a lawyer who specializes in the First Amendment rights of religious organizations, which is important, mm -hmm. having almost nothing to do with criminal law. I mean, what the president needs is a lawyer with experience in criminal law. He still doesn't have one. I mean, it is an extraordinary spectacle to see you know, the president reduced to legal Zoom, I think, to, uh, <laughs> to, to get who's going to represent him. I know, I, I don't think that's going to be the case. But, 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 just but he's got to resolve this question of whether or when he's going to be interviewed But do by you Mueller. really think that that's because impressive lawyers are turning it down, or he just hasn't cast a big enough net? Well, no, no, I, mean, are, I think it's I both of those. Yeah, yeah, it's they're both definitely turning they, it they down. Are, they are turning it down, and... and um, you know, I, I have no doubt that he will get another lawyer somewhere, but the idea that this extremely prestigious assignment Definitely. is being turned down because he doesn't listen to lawyers, right. he, doesn't, he thinks he's smarter than lawyers, he doesn't pay lawyers, I mean, this is a problem for him. <laughs> but the yeah. point, point Jeff is, is making also is important. Let's take a step back from the problem. It is extraordinary that a president is the subject of a criminal investigation from a special counsel under, from the FBI. And also that lawyers who normally would line up for the prestige of representing the president are running the other way. And remember James Comey's initial conversations with the president, even before the inauguration, Trump kept pressing him to say, well, I'm, I'm, you're not looking at my behavior, you're not looking at me, are you? Right. And Comey fenced around that. Now we know they certainly are looking at right. the Well, and by the way, all of this is going to go on, whether the president is interviewed or not. Jim Comey's got a book coming out. He's going to go to war publicly with the president. Right. There's going to be all of this back and forth. This is going to be rehashed, which is the very subject of whether the president obstructed justice or not uh, in the course of this investigation. All that's going to play out.